Hello and welcome to this again amazing video. We are recording this on 24th of July 2022, 9.38 p.m. Thank you so much for joining and we are going to talk about something very interesting. In this morning, I was like, okay, what can be today's piece of content and just just flip and just keeps like a First, I'll talk about the content creation because a lot of a lot of a lot of times what happens is I am struggling with content creation. There are a lot of people struggling with content creation, and when it comes to the Academy of Artists and Scientists, we I don't use the terminology content, but what we use is asset. Content is short term, short lived. Assets are long term, long lived, which will give you money, which will benefit people out. It's a win 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 situation for all. So we are not. Uh, though I kind of brought you in saying the content creation, but then we are going to talk about asset creation. Cool. 15 ideas to kick starting your asset creation journey YouTube strategies. Cool. I'm no expert in this domain, but then I've been recording videos. I've published over 200 videos on YouTube. I've got more than 150 videos in stock, 10 minutes each video, which are going to be published two videos on a daily basis. So I've kind of gained like 2% of confidence and 2% of experience in what I'm doing. So how do you do? two videos on a daily basis so today i'm recording this video on maybe i've crossed i've crossed 100 days maybe today's my 105th day or 107th day on a consistent basis two videos on a daily basis so that that way i'm kind of able to say okay i'm going to share with you how do you do this so that you will be benefiting out of this because one thing that i tell to people and the members of the academy is you do something like this for on a daily basis for two times you see how fast and how quick you're going to grow this journey so point number one is going to be share strategies with people Cool. When you share strategies with people, strategies I'm going to talk about in second minute. Straight, straight, sharing strategies, sharing frameworks. People love strategies. People love frameworks. When you give them the framework, when you give them the strategy. Okay, two plus two is equal to dash. Is equals to four. Now, when you have the answer four, okay, dash plus dash plus dash is equals to four. Dash minus dash minus dash is equal dash minus dash is equals to four. Dash plus dash minus dash is equals to four. That's a framework. Fill in the blanks. People love frameworks because they are not able to create a framework because they have they are too busy in what they're doing and they just want a shortcut. They just want to like if someone can help me out with this framework, it'll be great for me. That's a framework. That's a strategy. Cool. Create frameworks and strategies for people and share it through videos or through blogs or through bot podcasts so that people it becomes their life more easier. So these 15 strategies that I'm going to share with you is going to help you create immense amount of content, immense amount of assets which is going to benefit people. Point number three is going to be thought process. Uh, something that I've learned say good one and a half year back or two years back was a thought leader is someone who expresses his or her thoughts through a means statement what is what did that that blog i was reading it on a blog what is what is what is that blog meant was you don't have to filter things you don't have to read things you don't have to go watch and consume a lot of things what do you think about a subject just those thoughts has to be voiced out through a piece of content through a, through a more through a medium a video podcast or a blog focus got it <clears throat> That happens now when a thought process when you're sharing a thought process through a video people are benefiting out of it people are seeing where you stand what do you do what do you do what what do you do how do you do it how what don't you do it what 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 what, what do you do it what you don't do it so people get to know what type of person you are through adding value and you can share thought processes perspectives on what you have point number four five and six are going to be very interesting ones which is going to which you can add it in any content piece any piece of content that you've got pillars foundations and verticals of something cool pillars of calligraphy pillars of getting confidence in calligraphy pillars of creating a video Pillars of editing a video, pillars of publishing a video, pillars of having confidence while creating a presentation, pillars of designing the nail business, nail polish business. Pillars, like what are the pillars of doing something? Pillars of drinking water, pillars of driving a bike, pillars of scuba diving, etc. 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 Pillars. The same goes with foundations of something. No matter what you're doing, foundations of calligraphy, foundations of of, of, of choosing the right proof for your foundation, of dressing the right way, foundations of etiquettes of eating, for example, 
there are pillars foundations and verticals of something verticals are different methods of doing something then we've got seventh eighth ninth seventh and eighth are going to be seventh is the ways and approaches of calligraphy ways and approaches of of productivity ways and approaches of reading a book ways and approaches for becoming great at algebra ways and approaches of becoming great at accounts then the eighth point is methods of doing xyz methods of designing methods of designing your home designing your office designing your designing your designing a studio apartment designing a studio office methods like you have method one method two method three there are so many options you can do then we have got ninth one something my favorite is your perspectives of something cool there are things that you stand by there are things you don't like there are things you agree in a way there are things you don't agree to you can create content around these things for example you saw something on the road you may agree to it you may not agree to it you watch something on the tv you watch you heard a dialogue from a movie you have you interacted with someone you like the conversation you did not like the conversation so these are your perspectives you can record this and share it through a video share it through a blog share it through a podcast so that people resonate with you or if they don't who who doesn't resonate with you we don't want them. we want to add value to people who resonate with us so the perspectives the 10th one is untold secrets slash experiences where there are untold secrets of entrepreneurship journey there are untold secrets of productivity that i do there are untold experiences that i want to share with people for some reason i haven't shared it yet i'm going to share it later on. so there are what makes me fuzzle is a lot of different things that i do not 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 all of the people watching this or not all of the successful people do what i do the certain things i do and i don't as per the personality based so i want like you can share these secrets or these experiences with people if you are doing something implementing something what was what benefited you what were the benefit you got what are the disadvantages this what were the negative things you could have <coughs> sorry about that the 11th one is what are the magical beautiful experiences you had for example you you are an introvert you are into entrepreneurship journey you are helping people with calligraphy cool what was the magical or beautiful experience you had when you started doing journaling something completely different when what was a magical and beautiful experience you had when you started off traveling you can share something which is completely disconnected to what you are doing so that you are just voicing out your perspective to the people people may resonate people may not resonate but you've got create in create content all right 11 12th one is going to be lessons you learned the easy way slash the hard way people love these both you, you, you can either talk about the good way easy way that you've learned you can also not either you can also talk about you can talk about easy and the hard not all easy and the hard way talk about lessons you've learned lessons you've learned when you started reading book habit lessons you've learned when you stopped reading book habit when you stopped the habit of reading books like why did you stop it what made you stop it what good you did what 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 started to happen like what like all these cool things what are the lessons you did people love this 13th one struggles crazy struggles you went through so people go through n number of struggles on a daily basis on a moment to moment basis so what are the struggles you went through in 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 your calligraphy journey in in your gardening journey in your designing in your designing web designing journey in your room designing journey in your interior designing journey people like this and something that i can with people is when people can share subtle struggle with me okay this is what i've been through i can connect more rather than success success is what we can see struggles are what we don't see and when someone is sharing me with the struggle what happens is i can connect like it dude even that one feeling i felt it what you've been through like 5 years back i can feel it now so that that story becomes like an inspiration for me so we like this i love this 14th one uh, lessons from new version of you to the old version of you people love this i love this where today you are at a state So today you are at a stage not a stage you are at a stage after a struck after a journey not a struggle after a journey what would be your advice is to the five year old fuzzy see that people the people like this i like this the uh, 15th one is habits you picked on this journey so this was more strategic like, like i was not having ideas like it. 15th one can be habits that made you what you are today you can share this in multiple angles your spiritual habits a video your 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 physical habits a video you are uh, your personal development habits your uh, your financial habits your business habits your relationship habits your travel habits 
you can create content around anything now when you say when you talk about the spiritual habits you look at what are the what are the pillars of spiritual habits that i created what are the foundations of spiritual habits that i created what are the what are the ways of spiritual habits that you can create in a way so one piece you just have like one anchor to it and 15 ideas it just branches out to it I have given you 15 crazy insane amount of maniac version of ideas. Now the challenge is to do videos on a daily basis. Record it, edit it, publish it on a daily basis on YouTube. It will be fun challenge. See how long you can make it. I came all the way to I think I've crossed 100 days, so the challenge for you is going to be like create for 100 days in stretch. See because this 15 pieces can just keep on multiplying in so many ideas that you've got. Cool. Now the challenge I wish you do it for 100 days and let me know. I'm going to reward you with. I'm going to gift you with something because that will that will that will inspire other people as well. So thank you so much for making this video. Me and the topic of our video go make insane amount of content, which is eventually going to benefit people. Thank you so much. May peace and blessings be upon you and your loved ones.